Hello everyone, welcome to the Bug Expert channel. In this video, we will talk about solutions for friends who encounter NFS Unbound DirectX error. This error occurs when the graphics card is out of date. Of course, we may encounter such an error not only because of this problem, but also because of many other problems. For this, you can reach the solution of the problem by following the suggestions below. Before we show you solutions, we will briefly talk about the forum. You can forward various errors you encounter to the community on the forum portal we have opened. For this, if your problem continues or if you encounter a different problem, you can get a quick response by sharing it on the forum portal. We care about your questions and suggestions. In such continuity problems, we may encounter an update error on the graphics card. For this we will need to update the graphics card. For this, download the program suitable for your graphics card in the article and check whether there is an update request. To check the update request, open the program you installed and check if a new update is available by going to the driver option. If there is a new update request, restart your computer by updating and check. First we will need the utility to completely remove the driver updates on our graphics card. For this, let's download the DDU program by clicking the link we left in the article. Let's run the program we downloaded by extracting it into any folder. Set your graphics model by selecting the GPU option in the program and click the Clean and Restart button on the top left to start the driver removal process. After the uninstallation process is complete, restart your computer and request an update through the program we downloaded, and restart your computer by performing the installation process. If your problem persists despite performing the above mentioned process, you may encounter such a problem if you overclock the graphics card. For this, you can eliminate the problem by lowering or restoring the operating frequency of your graphics card. For this, run MSI Afterburner. Set the core clock and memory clock options to zero under the clock main heading in the program. After this process, save the process by clicking the confirmation icon below. After the process is complete, you can check if the issue still persists. If your problem persists, we can fix the problem by editing the registry. For this, let's type regedit in the start search screen and open it. Then let's get to the file path I showed in the video. If there is the TDR level registry, double click it on the screen that opens. If not, right click on a blank screen, select new, select word 32 bit, set its name to TDR level and double click. Then set the value to 3 and save. After the save process is complete, restart your computer and check if the problem persists. If your problem persists, let's double click the TDR level registry again and set the value to 0 and save. After this process, let's restart the computer and check if the problem persists. If your problem persists despite performing these steps, download the library files by accessing the link in the article and check if the problem persists by performing the installation procedures and restarting your computer. Yes. In this video we have provided information on how to fix NFS Unbound DirectX error. If you are encountering various errors, you can reach the community with your questions by accessing the forum portal we have opened. By supporting us, we can expand our community. Thank you.